Hello everybody, welcome to game one of Potato Blood, up against Norse, wonderful. I want to fang everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their fucking life. Thank you, Kerlon and Volk. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, something like that, J5, yeah. Call them all Rob or Tom or Gronk and Brady, yeah. Yeah, oh, the Brady Bunch, I could call them, couldn't I? Could call them the Brady Bunch. That would uh, that would please Skuro. I'm sure. Maybe I shouldn't have kicked. It's like it's always tempting just to beat up Norse, isn't it? Look, I can, this can be my, the name of my team. <laughs> so I can still get the Gadenic. <coughs> yes! Yes, Mr. Brady! <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> I wish I just could like win games of Blood Bowl just every time. It'd be pretty good, wouldn't it? <laughs> Fun fact: trying to make a YouTube guide about <laughs> about uh, scoring a two turn. I literally couldn't because every time I blocked, I just turned over. <laughs> it like took three times until I just gave up. <laughs> oh, <dear. sighs> Flip me. No, Kemri's shit, Volk. Kemri's shit. Don't don't pick Kemri. Oh. <sighs> yeah, man. Yeah, that's true stuff. Well, this guy's got three on the LOS. Did he think he was kicking? God only knows. In a team with 8 out of 11 players with block. <laughs> the blocks are made by the non-block players. Classic, instant removal.
but he's just doing a pass. <laughs> yes, Tim. End the turn for fuck's sake! End the fucking turn, man! Mm. New to Blood Bowl. New to Blood Bowl. Hey, <laughs> get out of it. I'm going to find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their fucking life. It does look like a Norse Dacker, yeah. yeah. I think he's just new to Bloodborne, he's not trying to Dacker, he's just a bit uh, struggling. to Blood Bowl. <laughs> Playing Jim, not Elvis. Thanks, Tom. Thanks, Tim. Four. 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 So it didn't look like it actually. Runner and a berserker. Mm. Yeah, absolutely fine team. Nothing wrong with the team selection. <laughs> Way. Oh. It's annoying because like you know, he's new to Blood Bowl, he's what played about twenty games ever. Of course he's not gonna be fast, but it's just it's just boring to play against, isn't it? Someone taking so long. Like it's obviously nothing against him at all. But it's just unfortunately <laughs> A bit shit. <laughs> the only thing to do is spam sound effects. <laughs> 
I didn't realize it was that long. I have potato blood in my veins. <laughs> mm, maybe. I could be the same person. Maybe he's played in leagues. End the turn for fuck's sake! End the fucking turn, man! Yeah, like it's fair enough. The time is there for people to take. Like, there's nothing wrong with it or anything. It's just like. It's just a bit. crap, isn't it? Amazing, rude both his ulfs <laughs> and two hits. Sometimes lucky. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah, it is like being behind a learner driver. Yeah, exactly, right? You've got to learn, haven't you? And it's like, I mean, to be fair, I, I felt like a complete scumbag when I was learning to drive, but still. So he might be feeling bad that he's taken a long time, but it's just like, it's fair enough, isn't it? People need the time, they need the time. It is what it is. And even if they weren't new, you've got the time, it's up to you to use it. Like, it's totally fair, it's not having a go at them personally, it's just... It's just flippin' boring. To watch and participate in. <laughs> yeah, find me. I, I, I asked, being a great stealer of content, for somebody to write like a polite way of saying it, because I just always fuck up and piss people off. Like I'm terrible. I'm terrible at like talking to people. So I just don't know how to do it. I just literally don't know how to, to do it. Amazing. Oh wow, that was that. That was the same blitzer as Kazda. Kazdanulf and Kaodanulf in two hits. What a badass. He's in a bit of a pickle here, isn't he? He might be saved by the fact that just, you know, herb derping is pretty good. <laughs> <Find me. laughs> yeah, there's there's a bunch of people that I'm sure just have have forgotten to cancel it. <laughs> well, not, it could be a girl. It is possible. Fuck off, that doesn't work. Hello. Oh my god. Right. Hello, are you new to Blood Bowl? Can you stop dicing me? Thank <laughs> you. 
Kampf war. That sounds super offensive. Hey, I knew because you play shit. You're all a bunch of dicks. You are literally all a bunch of dicks. Dicks, pussies and assholes. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, bloody nice, man. <laughs> yeah, the old terrorists. <laughs> Never forget the great terrorism of 2021. Or 2022. Which one was it? I think it was 21, wasn't it? It was when the... Uh... Oh, fuck off, red hair. Don't even... Don't actually do things. Don't actually say anything fucking stupid. I said to get off the screen as well. Don't like, don't be a fucking bell end. Don't like, seriously. You know, it's one thing to joke about things, but it's another thing to actually fucking type something that's like that, isn't it? You know. Well, it's okay to like. <laughs> yes, drunken more, but it's okay to reference the kind of idiotic thing that happened. In Artemis's chat, isn't it? Well, so so much for my surf there. Oh, you fucking bell end! Where's a blitzer? Uh, can you blitz anyone? No. Jesus, what a fucking pathetic time. Even numbers, anyway. Even numbers. Thanks, Red Hair. Yeah, sort it out. There's also uh, one that I haven't ma made yet, which is I will fucking drop kick Jesus, but I, I haven't made it one yet. I need to ask, ask calcium. Yeah, I probably did. I I do. I'm really good at offending people. I'm really good at like saying the wrong thing, doing the wrong thing, offending people, all those all those sorts of things. You would really have to start apolog apologizing in Spanish. <laughs> mm. I'll 
have to hire Rick as my personal apologizer. And he does some good things. Like, it's weird, right? Because some things are pretty terrible, but then he's got the right ideas about some things. Which is really quite bizarre, isn't it? Well, that's really good, isn't it? Because, you know, hitting this guy is the obvious thing, and then pow and get the assist in for this, right? And then that's, that's brilliant defense against it. Because it makes it one day as well, so I think I just do I just one day here. Motherfucker. Okay. Yeah, like he's played pretty well. Like it is weird, isn't it? He's played like some pretty good. He's done some pretty good things, despite like starting off about as badly as he could have done. He's done some good things. It's pretty weird. It's pretty weird. And he did some other good cover things, like when he was on the sideline. It was it was a weird combination of like awful. And and actually, you know, approaching optimal, I would say. <laughs> Big brother to go, maybe. I can score, I don't even know. Two turn back. Wow, he's not even doing it. No Volk, as I said, he does some things badly, but some things quite well. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with that. <laughs> I mean, Space Cadet entertains well and rants well, doesn't he? Credit where credit's due. Um. Space Cadet definitely rants well. And, uh, and there's a fun, a fun guy to watch, in my opinion. Yeah, not many people, not many people realize that guard is just not required whatsoever.
give him something to worry about up the middle. Should have done this block first. Ah. He needs to cover over here somehow. No, drunken mole. No, no. Yes, he's he's definitely the most prolific Norse coach on Twitch. Yes, can agree with that. Best Norse wrestler. Uh, there is Thor. There's Thor. And, uh, I mean, he's he's identical to Maul Plovak. Um, <laughs> but I'm pretty sure Thor... I'm pretty sure Thor's the best Norse wrestler, isn't he? He's an actual god. And he's won the world title before. <laughs> but, um... I mean, what is a Norse coach, right? At the end of the day. At the end of the day, what is a Norse coach, right? How many people mostly play Norse, right? Um, not many people mostly play Norse. So, if if you define a Norse coach as somebody who plays exclusively Norse, then he's, there's going to be very, very few people that exclusively play Norse. And he's better than average, isn't he? Basically? It's not like I'm saying he's terrible or anything. He's better than average. What the hell happened? Uh, he went back. He went back. I didn't power him. And then he went back. And then he went inside again. But he's not in range, is he? 12, 11, 10. So... Um, it depends what you want, Team on table. Um, if you want top three... For this season. And then the other one, I think, is... Yeah, Colian. Colian plays a lot of Norse, doesn't he? I guess Colian would be the number one, just because of how, like, you know, he's got the, the games played. Col Colian's played a fair bit of Norse. I, I would say, I would say Colian would be the person I would most associate being a bit of a Norse banger. Right, let's have a look. He can score. He can't. He can't. He can't. He can't. So there's been a bit of a fundamental error here from J94 in that he's got literally nobody who can score. Something to think about for sure. I've just pushed him into range. I thought I can't lose here. No, I pushed him into range. It's okay now, not a problem. Never in doubt. Disturbing presence in both isn't great, is it? <laughs> Lesson one, yep, don't. Don't push the ball into range in one day. Jesus Christ. Least I got a cast from it. Just just as planned.
And this should be a win now, shouldn't it? Stopped him scoring. Even outbashed him outrageously. Outrageously outbashed him. quite good against lizards I think because the things that make lizards good aren't good against ogres because they're, you know they're already strength 4 isn't better than strength 3 against ogres basically so they've got essentially 7 strength 3 players rather than not Yeah, the skinks are a nightmare. But... Like, I think they're one of the better... One of the better teams for... Uh, for Augers, I guess. No, not really. I mean, that's not true. But they're one of the... <laughs> oh, God. One... Augers isn't as advantageous comparatively for lizard men than it is for other races. Does that make sense? Like, you don't crush them as well as you'd expect. But, like, it's obviously still massively favourable. Like, it's, it's obviously still massively favourable. But. But they're not. It's not as bad as you'd think. Yeah, that's that's more like what it's how I'd describe it. So he's down three versus two. So I guess I've got to just receive and. I mean, I'm receiving. What I mean is, like, play properly. Don't duck it. Whoa. Glorious cast. <laughs> was there a get the ref or was there? yeah, oh, there was a get the ref. I don't know if that was la I didn't know if that was last game or this game. Double one on the foul. Oh no, it was double three. I thought it was a double one. I needed a three to break. It wasn't an auto break. Never mind. I literally thought I'd roll the double one on the. Other.
I mean, it's it is terrible for me. Uh, yeah, I mean, augurs augurs do. Well. Orgs are a lot better, but then orgs aren't really orgs, are they? They're just morg and stuff. Morg and griff, and it's just exploiting. It's just exploiting star players, isn't it? It's all ogres and snoplings and goblins and halflings do now. Exploit star players. It's also the only option available to Norse. <laughs> And Nurgle, <laughs> which is arguably a bit shit. Right, this uh, this match will be on soon. You know. This match, there's a playoff match starting in 20 minutes. I don't know if there's any lovely people up for doing the cast live. God, glorious! It's a uh, it's a Blood Bowl match, um, where both both people will be playing Blood Bowl. Four, thanks, Dadle. Four. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Do I foul him again? I'd like to foul him again. Good. Uh, Blood Bowl 3's release date is 2022. So there you go. Yawn that in the ear and then saying, sorry, I've lost interest now. <laughs> that was the best one, wasn't it? That was the best one. Sorry, I just. <laughs> 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 the cast, the casts are pretty good as well, aren't they? That's another way to piggyback off other people's content. You know, I'd rather that sounds better than stealing, but you know, same kind of thing, isn't it? It's pretty good. <laughs> Thanks, Jada. <Peter. laughs> oh, <dear>. <laughs> 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 Imagine if they said it in like the Champions League final or whatever. Blitzed. No. <laughs> this is devastating, devastating stuff. Just block. Roll pushes until I roll both downs. Why not? Good. Payoff. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So here's probably good. Ha! Oh shit, I didn't realize that was two dodges. I thought it was just a two plus. Whoopsie. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it'd be great, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it'd be amazing. <laughs> like, in the NFL when they break down players and stuff, you know, things like that. They could just be like... Uh, Romo would be like, oh, this is really exciting because what he does here, he sees the coverage coming, like, moving over and he calls out the mic linebacker and, oh, do you know what, I've just lost interest. <laughs> Let's move on. <laughs> 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 Brady's gonna be an analyst, isn't he? That that'll be amazing. Romo's been completely amazing, to be fair. So it'll be interesting to see what Brady's like. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? I mean, it doesn't. I mean, it doesn't matter, does it? Like, to be fair, the money literally doesn't matter. I've got no idea how much he's getting, but it doesn't. It's not going to matter to him whether he's getting a hundred million or one million a year, is it? <laughs> like, I don't know how much he's getting at all. What, five, ten, maybe? But it just literally doesn't matter. <laughs> Wow, so he's getting more than 15. <laughs> That's surprising that it's that much, isn't it? Yeah, Giselle has got more money than him, right? It's like, it's just nuts. Not anymore. Has she has she has she lost it all somehow. <laughs> did she did she gamble it all away? <laughs> Ten years and three hundred and seventy five million. Other industry sources put his annual take at somewhere between twenty and twenty five million. So there you go. So I think that's close to fifteen, right? That's close to fifteen, twenty and twenty five. In fact that probably is about fifteen million, isn't it, actually? So that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that about fifteen million a year. It's not that crazy. Oh, Aikman and Romo get 36 and he gets 37 and a half. But again, they're not posting their sources or anything here. Oh, he's in the studio and not even doing the Romo. Oh, wow, that's a shame. Romo's so good. Like, just genuinely one of the best uh, people that I've heard. I, I tell you who I like from the football side of it. Um, the Boring Scouser, whatever his name is. Um, 
Do you know the one? The boring, the boring, the boring Scouser. Danny Murphy. I think Danny Murphy's really good. Some people are just good. This has been a pretty good game against Norse, actually, hasn't it? Six cars. Two KOs. Four. Is he not Scouse? He's a bit like it, isn't he? He's a bit like a... He sounds like a boring Scouser. Do you know what I mean? Like, he doesn't sound like... He's not like, hey, 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 hey. But he's... Like, I guess he played for Liverpool for a long time, so maybe he picked up the accent. I don't know where he's from. Like he sounds proper boring. Like it's, hey, it's like he's not the best in terms of voice and stuff. But um, I like it when he talks about football. <laughs> like I think the content, the content is good, but the deliveries are horrific. I'm gonna find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their fucking life. Oh wow. Wow, 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 wow. Nearly done it. Nearly done it. The dream. The absolute dream. Yes! <laughs> Get up there! Woo! Now to throw away the win. I'll go and get the tune in now because he'd get players back. He'd get caught, he'd get players back. But I mean, I'm getting the SVPs that would be equal to it nearly anyway, right? Got two completions, got targeted on him. <laughs> Didn't get punched at all. Hello, Dark Force. Better now. Not so good at the start of this match, but better now. After wrecking Norse. Instant blodger. Loads of SPPs in the line, isn't it? It is, yeah, power picker. It really is, yeah. It really is so good. Oh, got the blitz would have definitely would have definitely won, wouldn't it? Scored another one. Nah, maybe it was worth it. I, don't know. I could have won to somebody. It does suck to be the guy, but you know, you, that happens to you too, doesn't it? So you've got to, you've got to be able to enjoy it when the shoe is on the other foot. 
No time for anything in the match. End of the match. The old turn 16 pointless death. Woo! Flip me, guys! Woo! So happy. That's what we needed to lose 70k. Give me 50k. Yep, good. Line all levels. Wonderful. I've got the apple. Dead line always isn't the worst thing in the world. Got a blodger. Three block total is all right. Just need to get a good run going with this team now. Fingers crossed. Right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.